Okay, guys, one way to actually uh, level up, you know, very easily when you start specifically or even later on, but I'm going to show you a little trick. So technically, you're going to go in settings, you're going to go all the way down to uh, cycle target forward. You're going to keybind this to something, but me, I'm going to keybind it to tab and I'll show you why. So if I get out of here, you see, this is my number one slice. So this is for melee, by the way. So this is an, so this one is a three second spell, right? So what happens is if I have tab and one like next to each other, so let's I, I click tab, boom. So I'm going to be able to uh, target something that is next to me. But this is good for melee because they are all patched up together over here. I'm going to click one and it's going to attack. When it's almost done, I'm going to click tab right now, boom, and then one. See that? See how easy it is? So you just keep doing that. So you don't have to go anywhere. And then it's tab and then one. And all your auto, all your spell will auto attack. It's just for beginning when you start, and you don't want to like left click, left click, left click, left click, left click, right? Just tab, and then one. And you can loot too as well. Don't forget to loot. I'm use, I'm gonna use that for cooking after. Tab, one. See how easy it is. Also, the other thing you need to understand is. There you go. So you level. The other thing that you need to understand is um, when you click over here combat setting uh, you got to make sure in combat mode you have revolution combat mode because this will allow you to automate your abilities on your main action bar right so you want everything to be automatic well I mean if you don't want to do anything you know but I mean if you want it to make it easier for you unless you want to manually click all of them but but you see me I use uh, revolution combat mode so that's what you need in order to automate everything so now I'm gonna click tab again and one and you can do the same thing with range uh, with magic, you can do this the same thing with any uh, class, tab, and then one. That's it. If you get higher level, uh, you know, then you can do the same thing as long as all the mobs are, you know, are there in front of you. But if you're like, like magic or if you're like uh, range, then you can do that to mobs that are far away from you. That's the advantage of range. And, but melee, but when you're using melee, like uh, this melee class, you have to be next like the mobs needs to be next to you in order for this to be effective if possible so that you don't have to run too far you know what i mean so a tab and then one you see how easy it is the other thing is when you gather all these raw rabbit meat you can actually go to the cooking station which is like just north like look i was actually over here and it's only over here like the north where there's like a cooking stove right so you're gonna go from here to here right and you're just gonna go to the cooking thingy over here and you just level up your cooking Simple as that. There we go. And you can use the uh, the meat for later on. I me, I usually put them in the bank. You know, all the cooked meat. And I um, the one that is burned, I just drop them. I just remove them. And I keep rinse and repeat. And I do that until I'm satisfied. Then I go to a area with higher level mobs, which you know, like if I'm comfortable to, you know, attack them with my combat skill. So that's how you level up faster. I mean, if that's what you want and it's easier for the fingers as well. So I hope it helps you. If it does, please like and sub. Thanks for watching. Cheers.